you guys back to the yard every few minutes with another super be loaded. Yeah, this is happening quick here. Well, I guess that's good because the field's disappearing pretty fast too. in this part of the field. I'm getting 35, 37 bushels to the acre right in this part. Yeah, they were very close to uh, treating a lot more beans, eh? Yeah, uh, there's a lot more plant matter there than what there is beans, really. I think it's so close to making a 40 bushel crop. Uh, level. He was wondering about bringing it back to the main farm the chemical and said, well, we're actually done with chemical. Yeah, I gotta go. That big old 2000 would be nice right now, eh? Yeah, well, and the bummer is I've already got 17,000 from that peak in my cart, so whatever, I'll get you guys going, and Joanne will have to get you at that other end again, and we'll play catch up for a few minutes. You'll meet him back at that end there, yo. I'm assuming south end is what you're getting at? Yep. Yeah, you bet. Oh, Code, would you like me to be faced the other way so the tarp is not in your road? Ah, don't worry about it, Grant. It's, it is nice that way, but we're not in a rush. Okay, I am shutting the truck down. Okay, I'll take these guys once it's handy and then come in with a decent load. Halfway 
way down the field or something. Suppose I could. Do you want me to take the rear combine or something? Or? I've already taken them. I gotta take the middle one, and then I gotta dump, and then I gotta go take Uncle Rick for it again. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'll cruise up here with you. Yeah, I think so, great. Like, if it's gonna go into your... Hopefully it'll go into that non-aerated bin and one bag. We have a cart coming out. It's gonna be a tad late, but we're a mile from the cart right now. Be in the pickup. Great's probably got a truck already set up on that bin, eh? Yep, he's still dumping there. Yeah, I don't know if the combiners can hear me or not, but the uh, auger we fixed last night is running flawlessly so far and sounding really good. Thanks for the update there, yo. That's real good. I'm glad to hear it. I've been checking top bearings too, and they're all staying nice and cool, so that's good news. She fits code, but it's fairly tight on the till, so I take my time on the corners. You on the air there, Buckshot? Yes, sir. You're on your way back? Yeah, just leaving the main farm. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna fit this field, so you might have to grab a few hundred bushels or something and either come quickly dump it or remember to do a split load at the farm or something. I was just saying that we've combined tons of wheat in this same moisture position. Oh, for sure, yeah. I emptied the rain gauge and there was about two and a half tenths in there. Okay, thanks, Tink.
not sure how I made that fit code, but you're full. I need to chase you guys over there, or do I need to get dumped so we can change uh, next field? We all need to take a quick dump and change to the next field. Yeah, we're... Rick's just chasing up the last pass here, Slim. Okay. I'll maybe uh, chew a path to this uh, laneway here so we can get to the next field, and then it stays on the correct level. Does that sound okay? 10-4, yeah. Just cut one single pass up there and it'll get that looked after. You looking good, brother. Yeah, you too. Is this your... Uh, I guess this is kind of your second full load in that bin, hey? Yeah, that was, that first one was pretty much a full load. Did you get rid of a hopper in the last bin or not quite? No, not quite. Maybe half a hopper. Okay, once you get onto your uh, second last hopper there, you might want to tap it and just make sure, but you should be safe to fit. How's the 135 doing on that auger this year, Grace? Ah, it's working like a charm. Oh, that's good. Lentils are nice and dry, and I don't think there's too many greenies in there, is there? No, there's hardly any greenies. Okay, just stay right here. I started off cross country, but it was rough, so I'm just gonna head for the headland and then over. I'll be doing the same, Gordon. Cool.
for settings. I'm having uh, the tailing full alert coming up. I'm just wondering if you guys are having that same problem. 22 for clearance. 760 for speed on the rotor. 14 and 4. Rotor speed 770. Fan 760. Okay, and you guys aren't having the tailing full problem? Uh, no. Lift your header some more though. I'm having better luck getting away from those green leaves as much as I can. Come on out and play. You betcha. Still, still praying for that 40 mile an hour gear, but yeah, at the auger, I can definitely see how the retrasher wouldn't be happy with what you guys were putting in there. The screen is uh, plugging up with green chat, or what? Yeah, I could run the gate on that with the bags dropped on that truck. I could just run her wide open and would barely feel the auger. That's frustrating, eh? Yeah, some of it's pretty snotty, so hopefully it doesn't give trouble in the bin. Is the back combine fuller than the front combine? I got uh, just about 21,000. I think code we've, we've put canola away with that leafy, snotty crap in it before. But uh, these bins all need to be rotated like we do lots of years. Shouldn't be much trouble for you guys to jump right over to the far side or is that a pain in the butt? Probably doesn't matter, Coach. Would you like us to do that? Yeah, that would be good. I need one full cart to get Grady gone and then looks like it won't quite fit. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'll leave you back.